most families have problems. Sometimes families have problems which can lead to or be part of a more serious situation. Problems in what government have termed troubled families are usually complicated, with more than one family member's difficulties contributing to the overall situation. Whichever role is played in the family, problems can occur for anyone. Even when an individual issue is something small, a number of bad situations within a family can seem worse collectively, and the impact and influence that one issue has on another is often missed by professionals. Troubled families with multiple, complex and persistent issues can experience many types of problems like unemployment, poor school attendance, involvement in crime and antisocial behaviour, problems with drugs and alcohol, physical or mental health problems, domestic violence or abuse, being at risk of homelessness or unmanaged debts, young children failing to thrive and concerns about unhealthy weight or malnutrition. Needs like this are increasing, at a time when our resources and capacity to help are being severely tested. To embrace an environment for change, Hampshire County Council is leading a significant five-year voluntary programme with partners to begin to turn around the lives of at least 5,560 Hampshire families with multiple, complex and persistent issues just like these. Hampshire's Supporting Troubled Families programme has the long-term aim of our public sector agencies working more effectively together in new ways to make lasting positive changes to the lives of the families and communities across Hampshire. The concept is simple. Local workers identify families who would benefit from this collaborative working approach where one plan can be made rather than another assessment. It starts with local, multidisciplinary meetings and interventions to draw on and share existing local intelligence that will identify the complexity of the family's issues. Working in partnership and sharing data will enable the focus to be placed on families as a whole, giving better clarity to get the troubled family back on track more quickly and in a more cost-effective way. A caseworker is established based on their relationship with and knowledge of the family and works closely with all members of the family to understand what the problems are, what the best way of helping might be and to coordinate services once the plan is underway. One caseworker looking at the whole family is better than all of our departments trying to help all at once, with no overview of other problem areas elsewhere in the family. The caseworker's centrally focused plan to steer the family back onto the right track will enable the family to cope by dealing with one issue at a time. The Supporting Troubled Families program gets funding based on results. This funding is then used to provide direct support to families or for local areas to trial new, alternative approaches to support families with complex issues. A transformation now in the sharing of information and data, where whole family working becomes business as usual and best practice, will enable us to evidence better outcomes, to ensure the ongoing collaborations between our services and departments and better use of funding can be sustained beyond 2020. With more, increasingly complex challenges ahead, let's work together now for better outcomes for families and for their future generations. Visit our website to learn more about supporting troubled families, www.hants.gov.uk forward slash supporting troubled families.